Hello, I think that's my day uh, 64. I'm wearing a bright, bright t-shirt, so I don't know how it comes out. I don't know if it's making the camera a bit crazy. Like, I don't know, maybe it's just the screen. Kind of weird. Anyway, um, <sighs> I hope you guys had a nice weekend. I had a wonderful weekend. It was very sunny. I was like a lizard outside meditating in the sun. And I meditated with this book again. I went a little further in the book. It is awesome. I definitely recommend it. So if you guys can see, it's How Psychic Are You? Julie Soskin. And it's a beautiful book. Um, I went through the, uh, There were some things I wanted to share with you. I'm not interested in like reading the cross or reading the crystal ball that kind of thing um, but like there's some chapters using positive thought um, this no can you sense things that other, others can't this reminds me a lot of the Celestine prophecy um, getting in touch with nature. I'm going to read it for you. I'm doing a lecture here. Um, All flowers, plants, and trees generate beneficial energy which can be comprehended as their guardian spirits. To tune into this positive force, visit a favorite outdoor spot and let yourself be drawn to a particular tree, plant, or flower. And then they give you directions on how to do that, and it's it's a lot like um, a Celestine prophecy. I can read you some a uh, little bit of that. Sit under a close uh, by your chosen plant, so you move inside its aura. Uh, blah 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 blah. Receive the energy from the plant and quietly ask its guardian spirits to communicate with you. Blah blah. And um, I'm, I'm not going to read you everything here. You should just get the book. Then there's like a little bit of, this page is just beautiful, look at this. Look, I don't know if you can see the colors, but what the flowers say, and then there's a little bit about flowers. Meaning, and then there's an awesome chapter, it's called Enhancing Precognition. And it's called, Do You Know What's Going to Happen? in every time there's like a um a chapter there's like a test you know and they have you you know answer some questions and then they answer okay if you answer yes to this number of questions you've already equipped with the basic ability to experience precognition or learn to trust your hunches and feelings you've more than average sensitivity to use full out of the blue information or perhaps you should consider taking psychic development classes as you are in touch with extrasensory skills that could be successfully developed. So this is pretty good. Uh, they tell you how to um, enhance your protonation so that you can feel really confident. I don't know. It's really awesome. Other things. I don't really get it. But um, Oh, then. Oh, my gosh. This chapter. What do your dreams tell you? This was awesome. They talk about, or first they talk about a little bit of like dream analysis, but it's very, they present different aspects of interpretation, yet like a pragmatist, a behaviorist, a fru, fru, Freudian, I can't say it in English. I don't even know how you say it. Freud in English. Is it Freud? 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 Freudian? Whatever. Uh, Junian? <laughs> I don't know. Um, anyway, they talk about this, then dream meaning a little bit, and then there's this chapter, it's can you control your dreams, and I decided to try to do a little bit of this. They talk about lucid dream. Uh, it's just awesome. This is a lot of people are able to do this, so I'm interested in that. Uh, travel to other worlds in your dreams. And they have a cute little section. It's, is your pet psychic? 
and that was like very interesting they ask you know does your pet seem to understand your moods and feelings blah 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 so you know you would think that some pets maybe they just like sniff you but certain things that they talk about you just realize what a dog can a dog sniff that far away i don't know it's just really interesting how maybe with this like the little nose you know they can sniff our moods and you know when we're hurt and they come you know it's up like you and that kind of thing so it's cool and then there's other things that i was reading yeah like tarots cards i'm not interested in that but other things are cool um Like the pendulum, I don't know. I've oh yeah, what are your healing powers? They they give you some directions on how to heal yourself. That kind of, of stuff. Uh, I don't know how you guys are, but um, I've had some uh, stressful episodes in my life. I got sick. Like stomach sick or off balance, just off balance, like losing weight just you know not not digesting properly that kind of thing and, uh, and because of stress and so what are your healing powers that they they tell you how to you know connect to your um what's it wrong your prana energy so healing yourself first healing your garden and a lot of other things and then this is where and then of course healing using sound to heal the heart of music of course sing to your chakras it's pretty pretty cool meditating meditation exercises okay so that was all my stuff and i did do some music too uh, yesterday and i did get inspired with all this and i'm even more inspired today i started to do a little more of arrangements um on my song and uh, what else oh i talked today my friend that the other day got me mad i don't know if if you guys watched all my videos but there's this friend that when i talked to her it's like she's off like we're not in sync we're not connected these days or something's wrong and um and she just like made me mad like she made me anxious or she just doesn't tell me the right stuff at all or she doesn't think about what she should tell me instead it's just wrong I'm, and then it's off like it takes my energy out that like she's just negative negative and then she makes me anxious and then i start to think what well, should i worry about this i should write and i'm like no 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 so i wrote everything down like what i was at what i wrote down how my feelings, how I felt, like, you know, and then I, then I felt better, and I just thought out about it, because I, I kept being confident, but it was just silly, and she's so, she's so not in sync with me, that she even advised me some things about music, that this, this is not what I'm interested in anymore, and I mean, it's been a while, I'm not interested in that anymore, so it's to tell you how much she is off, but anyway. So, okay, well, I'm still working on my vision balls and things. So, I think that's all. I'm hungry. I just get home from work. So, I'm just going to go have dinner, work on my song. So, you guys have a good night and good luck with everything.